So, so we have put up to 422 meters now, and then uh, the diameter is now two meters, okay. uh, 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 in which we are putting the pod for testing, and we are also using it for the national, uh, uh, international, global hyperloop competition. Railways okay. has uh, announced of giving much uh, support, financial support, additional support uh, will be given, and they are now railways is now looking for some commercial project as well. So, with the additional support, how you are going to utilize it, and by when we can expect uh, roughly that a commercial project could actually take off. Ah, so, uh, see, with the the, the the next grant that is going to come, we will be. Uh, what we have done is lot of fundamental building blocks. We have experimented them, and they are successful, and that's why we are able to launch this global hyperloop competition. The next is uh, grant will be to go and freeze on many of these specifications because these are evolving specifications. Absolutely, sir. There are, there are only few uh, hyperloops in across the world. One was by Tesla at some point of time. Uh, uh, in Asia, this is the first uh, hyperloop competition we are held, holding here. So, so there will be a lot of uh, freezing of these technologies and finalizing the standards. And that is what we will be using this money for. And we are very confident that in Trinia, six to one year time, six months to one year time, uh, we will get certain uh, commercial interest specifically for cargo.